Amarin, Hank Lundy, Alex Martin. Ah, aqua fight, real aqua fight. And I felt I feel a bunch of ways about that fight. Um, I thought Hank did enough to get the win. At the same time, if he didn't win, I think it should have been a draw. I don't think he lost that fight. Um, did he give away some rounds looking for the big shot? Yes, he did. Um, but I don't think he lost that fight. And to be honest, Alex Martin didn't come to fight. You know what I mean? He 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 pulled it off. He did some good things here and there. But in, in my heart, I believe he didn't even really want to fight. You know what I mean? He, he thought the fight was going to be easy. And right away, he saw the fight wasn't going to be easy by getting knocked down. Short left hand landed by Hank Lundy. That, you know, that he shot right down the middle, landed on his chin. You know what I mean? He knocked him down in the first round, felt his power. And I think from there, he just really didn't even want to fight. His his aura coming out during the walk was, you know what I mean, cocky. He felt like he had it in the bag before he even got in there with Hank. Hank caused trouble from from the very beginning, especially um, coming out as a southpaw. You know, for years, Hank's been switching back and forth, but I always felt like, Better fighter at Southpaw, even when Hank was in the amateurs. Um, and he was giving he was giving Alex Martin trouble from the Southpaw side. He switched Orthodox a few times, but he didn't he couldn't really find the angle that he wanted. I felt like Hank Lundy though head hunted too much, um, too many big shots. I felt like Feudal been going to the body, slowing his man down. You know, what I mean, getting his legs to slow down a little bit. I think he would have found more success and definitely would have locked the win in. But did I think he lost the fight? Nah, I I, I think Alex uh, Martin did enough to get a draw. You know what I mean? After being knocked down in the first down, if I mean the first round. I'm sorry about that. Um, I just I don't know. I don't understand his decisions like that, especially when the guy was fighting out of a hole. You know what I mean? And he and he and he was landing some shots, but not nothing too crazy to to say that he was winning the whole fight. You know what I mean? From there on out, but I at least had Hank winning at least six rounds out of ten. You know what I mean? But hopefully Hank can uh, get back in the gym and, you know, work on some things and uh, get back in position for a fight like that. You know what I mean? That was a good fight for Hank. It was a good fight for Alex Martin. Um, congratulations to Alex Martin. He got the W, but I don't think he actually won the fight. It was a good fight, though. Um, Alex Martin, where does he go at 140 pounds? Again, the 140-pound division is loaded. You know what I mean? There's a lot of fights there. I think Golden Boy is definitely going to get him in position for uh, for any of those fights because he he has four losses and he had a lot of you know I me mean, a lot of flaws in his style. And I think a lot of guys would take the fight with him, even though he's a big guy. He's a big guy for 140 pounds. But all in all, you know what I mean? Again, I think Hank Lundy won that fight. So I, you know we got to do something about this judging. You know what I mean? These judges, I think, kind of be playing favorites. Um, it's been going on for years. That's one of the things that needs to be changed in boxing. But it is what it is. I think Hank Lundy's still going to go down in history as a great fighter. You know what I mean? I mean, he didn't be, get to become world champion, but he done some great things and upset a lot of people in boxing. You know what I mean? Hopefully, he can continue his career. You know what I mean? Continue to make some good money, things like that. Alex Martin, you know what I mean? He need a lot of work. Hopefully he can get some coaches behind him or a team behind him that can help him with that if, you know what I mean, he wants to really win something. Um, but I don't really see it in his future, to be honest. You know what I mean? I'm Greg Hackett. Check me out, Greg Hackett86 on Instagram, Greg Hackett on Twitter, Greg Hackett on Facebook. Thank you.